One of the things that's different about our Food Policy Council is it really started out of community action. The Detroit Black Community Food Security Network got together, started looking at what kind of access issues Detroiters were having, getting healthy foods, and came up with writing a food security policy for the city of Detroit. We have 21 council members from higher education institutions, K through 12, agriculture, everything in the room talking to one another on a regular basis. We also did a local voters guide. We asked people who were running for city council, what are your views about some of these food issues? It made them think, hey, this is important to people. And then you publish that, it makes voters think about, are these the values that I want reflected? We looked at that food security policy, the original one, and we updated it. We had 341 people to take our survey. Um, we held 11 listening sessions across the city to get people's input. We went to people working in food and talked to them. Right now, we're building interest across the city. We're meeting with um, council members on a one-on-one -on -one basis and other organizations to get that community support. When we went out and we talked about that update, this is the word cloud that came out of it. These are the things that were on people's mind. We're out at the farmer's market talking to people. Um, about food policy, about issues, of getting their viewpoints and exchange of information. We have a, f a film series. By bringing a film in and bringing a panel in and getting, making it fun and having some snacks there, it makes policy less intimidating and, and allows people to see how they can impact what is impacting them. One of the things that we're going to look at is the food system. Who's benefiting? Who's paying? Is everyone getting to participate? Do people actually have access to the things they, that they need? We're instituting a taste of African heritage class. So it's a nutrition class, but the real reason is it gets people talking about good food. Because so many of our allies don't know that they're our allies because they don't see the connections until we bring it up.